Hello, I'm Jasmine. This story is about Gay the Garden Girl and it's called The Carrots and the Ladybirds by Rebecca Mumford. In summer, Gay the Garden Girl had some carrot seeds. Here's her carrot seeds, spelling out the word carrot. Gay the garden girl planted the carrot seeds in her garden and the carrot plants started to grow. This is what carrot plants look like when they grow in the garden. Gay the garden girl pulled the carrots out of the ground when they were ready. The carrots were many colours, orange, purple, red, yellow and white. Have you ever had a purple carrot? I haven't. Instead of picking all of the carrots when they were ready to eat, Gay the garden girl left one carrot in the garden. After some time, carrot flowers grew on the plant. This is what carrot flowers look like. One Sunday, Gay the Garden Girl saw a lot of grey aphids on the carrot flowers. Aphids are a pest and can damage plants. Can you see the grey aphids here? On Monday, Gay the Garden Girl saw yellow eggs on the carrot flowers. Can you spot the yellow eggs? On Tuesday, Gay the Garden Girl saw baby ladybirds on the carrot flowers, called larvae. On Wednesday, Gay the Garden Girl saw teenage ladybirds on the carrot flowers, called pupae. On Thursday, Gay the Garden Girl saw beautiful red and black adult ladybirds on the carrot flowers. How many ladybirds can you count in that picture? On Friday, Gay the Garden Girl saw lots of eggs, larvae, pupae and adult ladybirds on the carrot flowers. On Saturday, Gay the Garden Girl saw there were no more aphids on the carrot flowers. The ladybirds had eaten them all up and saved the carrot plant. Very helpful ladybirds. Thanks to the ladybirds, Gay the Garden Girl was able to collect some new carrot seeds which had grown from the carrot plant she had left in the garden. The end, but really the beginning, because now she can grow some more carrots with her seeds.